Hey guys, thanks for tuning into your review channel. Do appreciate you tuning into this one. So if you ever put down some carpet in an area rug and you put it down and you walk on it and you almost fall, well, that's because you didn't put like a gripper or something underneath like a pad to stop it from moving. I'm gonna show you how to do that. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Let's get to the video. You know, if you have a carpet like this here, like an area rug, and it keeps moving every time you sit on your couch or every time you sit down or every time a person comes by, it keeps moving, that's because it keeps slipping. It doesn't have a backing on it. Uh, so most of the carpet you buy today are like this here, and it doesn't have and like an anti-slip backing or a padding to it. Uh, so I have a simple solution for you and a really quick tip. So if this is really can be scary. So if you're walking by sometimes and you're moving, you can slide, this thing, this thing will slide real easy. And that's, you know, you're sitting on the couch and it keeps moving. So a simple solution for this is these non-grip slippers. There's like rug slippers here. These are pretty kind of cool, they're called rug grippers. Um, and it's very simple. So it's a four pack in here and you put them in the four corners of the carpet. And what it does, it basically stops the carpet from sliding. Either hardwood floor, tile, laminate, anything whatsoever, it helps it from start moving. Okay, you open them up and you put them on the corners of the rug. So you put them on the four corners of the carpet, and what it does, it keeps it stable so it doesn't move, and that's important. So you put these four pieces on, we're gonna do this together, we're gonna show you how to do it, uh, and it works on wood, tile, and laminate. So what happens, you just open these up, take them out of the package, put them in the back of the carpet, like I said, the four corners, like you see here, and, it does it, and it's simple and it keeps the carpet from moving. So let's take it apart real quickly. Let's take a look at it and see how it works. There's four of these packages. I'll leave a link down below where you can pick up something like this. And it's kind of a cool thing, I like it. All right, so here we go. So we have four. One, two. I'm a little sticking here a little bit to this. There, you got four, okay? And then we have four of these white little thingies here. So what these do, they stick to the bottom of the, of the carpet. We're gonna show you that in one second, see how that works. Okay, here, so you can see here, this is a clear film, and this film is very sticky, and this is like a sticky, almost like a sticky pad. Uh, so let's take that off there, and you put that pad of paper, put this little sticky in this corner. You can barely see it. It's almost transparent, and it sticks right to the carpet, okay? Now you can't see it, but it does, it's there, which is kind of cool, and then you take your pad here, and there's two pieces of um, paper on here as well, so you just pull it off, okay? Take that one off here, and then you stick that right to this side here. You can barely see it. Oh my God, it's so hard to see. And that will go right here, okay? And then when you, before you stick it down on the floor, make sure your floor is clean, okay? And then you just pull off this pad here, this little sticky, um, this little protectant, and that will take that, make it really sticky and stick to the floor. So we'll leave that on for now until we do the other four corners and we're gonna pull these off, stick it to the carpet and see how it works. Let's do that right now. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe and I'll leave a uh, link down below where you can find something like this here uh, for your home, real simple to do for your carpet. Hey guys, I hope you're enjoying the video. I'm just gonna fast forward some of this so you can get an idea of what I'm doing. Um, if you're enjoying the video, please don't forget to like it. Let me know by uh, liking, that. hit that, that like button to let me know that you're enjoying this video. I do appreciate that very much. And also don't forget to subscribe. All right, let's get to finishing this up. Okay, let's go. Okay, so you can see now I have all four corners are all done. And I'll just give you a shot of that so you can see. All the four corners are all finished. You can see the four black dots right there. And those basically will stop the carpet from sliding. Um, also, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe if you're enjoying this video. I just want to make something real quick, real simple, simple, simple and inexpensive to not have your carpet move all over the place and very easy to do. Those big carpet padding moving things that stop it from moving are very hard to deal with and they're very difficult. This is a quick, easy solution. So all we have to do now is pull off these backings. Get this ready. Pull off that one. Pull off this one. Let's pull off this one. And let's pull off this one. So these here will stick to the actual floors and stop the cotton from moving. And let's get it into place where we want to put it. Okay guys, so I finished up the project and you can see here, it's all back in its place and it does not move at all. I'm telling you, I slid on it, I try to move it, it just doesn't move. It's really, really secure. I'm gonna try to pull this side up here because once you put it down, it stays down. Let me tell you something, this thing is tough. Uh, so I'll pull it up so you get a quick idea. It just sticks to the bottom of the carpet and then sticks to the floor, tile, laminate. It just sticks unbelievable. I mean, you just can't move it and I tried. And I have my little granddaughter comes over and she moves it, that, always moving that rug around. So now they, that won't happen anymore. And uh, that's it. All right, guys, so I hope you enjoyed the video. I don't make it too long. I uh, appreciate it as always. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. It does help me. And I'll see you at the next review.